Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Nothing to Fear at the Wealth Around Us. As you can see, this isn't going to be one of my doom and gloomers. Uh, this is going to be uh, more positive. But on the series of Nothing to Fear, I'd like to uh, go back on my friend Mark from Nuggets of Truth. Uh, did a video about chickens and why chickens didn't worry and maybe you shouldn't either and how chickens provide for themselves and pretty much don't worry about anything because they can provide, you know, they're self-sufficient. Well, this episode of Nothing to Fear, I would like to title The Parable of the Guinea Pig. Now, the guinea pig is another one that I've seen, another animal that shares a lot of things in common with people. The main thing not being a, a good trait. Guinea pigs were bred as food items for the Incas. As you can see, they really don't do a lot but look around and stare at each other. and They are completely and utterly, hopelessly dependent on their owners. If I were to take all three of these animals out, and uh, what in the heck is she doing? Oh, if I were to take all three of these animals out in the backyard and release them, just out of pity, guess what? They'd be right there until some bird of prey came along and got them. These animals have, the nature has been completely bred out of them. If not for me and their owners, they'd be very dead right now. Because they cannot take care of themselves. All they do is sit there and look at you and wait to be fed their allotment of food for the day. And it occurs to me, I only know one other animal that behaves like that, and that's us. So, that's basically the parable of the guinea pig. Don't be one. Learn how to survive, learn preparedness, learn skills that we've gotten away from as people, like I'm doing now, rearing animals, uh, getting back into that. If we don't, we're going to end up what you see before you hopelessly system-dependent guinea pigs. So thanks for watching, and remember, there's nothing to fear.